Well, this is my first um, tutorial. Well, my first demonstration of my um, uh, my game. Um, this is Dragora. Uh, base. Yeah, well, let's see what we got so far. Basically, so far, it's only been the city, and I'm still working on it. All right, let's go back out here. Not a bad city. I'm trying to figure out whether I might have done it too big or not. Uh, one of the problems with um, doing this at first is that you don't know what to do. You know, exactly how to do things and you have to figure it out for yourself in a lot of cases. This guy here, um, well, uh, his name's Trulane. Um, he's kind of like a historian of these parts. Um, he's not a major story figure, but um, he gives you uh, a quest that will pretty much um, last um, the whole game. But it also adds a nice feature to the game because each one of each one of these pages that you find um, gives a nice little story, um, additional story to the game. I'm trying to hurry on through it because there's some bugs still left to work out of course. And the main story element I hadn't um, put in here yet. So right now it's just the city, just the NPCs and me and you being able to talk to them for right now. Um, but there is a major plot line that's supposed to be um, happening inside the city. Uh, um, one thing I'm noticing in about my storyline so far is that although I do like the storyline, um, it, it is a little repetitive because it requires you to go back to certain places that you've already been. Um, something that I would like to like to lessen. Uh, I don't think I would get rid of it altogether, but I would like to lessen it to where you don't have to do that much backtracking. So you got tons of these right here. I also have the um, have the ability to have dual weapons. Um, you will have to equip the other weapon yourself. And right now, I haven't figured out exactly how to um, show the addition in attack that you know, you know um, that an extra weapon would get you. Um, right now, whenever you um, put, uh, even though you do get extra attack from it when you equip it, it doesn't show it from when you first buy the weapon. Like if you got two of the same weapon, like the bronze swords here, um, it doesn't show like the difference between what, uh, what having only one weapon and having both weapons would be. I have tons of NPCs all through this thing. I won't bother talking to them all, of course, uh, but I just wanted to give a nice little tour 
for the city without trying to explain too much of the plot because you know I want you to try out the game I might change the game on um, the town music <laughs> The mapping wasn't done too badly, I think. Um, I'm not, I don't think I'm good enough at it just yet to, um, have a tutorial on it because I'm still figuring out size well, like I said it's a pretty big town All right, this is basically the second half of it here Not much to this side here. Um, basically, you have um, the pub where all the cadets seem to like to hang out and stuff. And since this is um, this is supposed to be like a big day. Um, kind of like a recruitment day. There are lots of people who aren't cadets that are here right now. Normally this is a school filled with, you know, basically cadets and um, the older citizens that were here before, um, before this town um, was turned into a school. Um, this should will be the the entrance before you get to the, um uh, uh, before you get to Renworth Castle, um, and of course this guy will stop you here, um, but I haven't programmed that in yet. Alright, so this is a short introduction um, to Dragora. Um, I'm planning on chopping off the the legends part, so I'm just gonna call it Dr Dragora because it you know it, it sounds too much like another um, guy's title um, that I had found on the rm2k.net um, um, forums. Um, I had already had this name in mind, and but he had um, he had a game called um, I think it was Dracora Legends. Um, So, there we go. Anyway, um, thank you for watching, and I hope to make more of them.